this data on compost. So we have um, agricultural technology and management degree, uh, food science and technology degree program, and our uh, newest edition animal science and fisheries program. So all together, we have uh, provided avenues for about 350 students to uh, excel in their academic um, careers uh, under our um, So this is uh, a testament to the excellence of higher education that we provide in the Faculty of Agriculture. So this is uh, a very good example uh, where we have scored three A's for all our degree programs that are offered at the Faculty of Agriculture um, at the program review that was held in 2019 by the University Grants Commission. So we are absolutely proud of this as well. Um, so this is some good news for all our, our prospective students and our graduates. Um, according to statistics, 94% of, of our graduates find employment within one year of graduation. This is also a significant milestone of the practice. So Faculty of Agriculture is quite unique in its setup because we have eight departments of study. Um, where are, these departments of studies are actually quite mutually exclusive and they will provide us um, in-depth knowledge in a wide, uh, wide uh, area of study. So I'm not going to go into a lot of detail. You will be able to see some of this information when you visit uh, the good exhibition today. So we start with the Department of Agricultural Biology, that is where I am from. And we have Department of Agricultural Engineering. And who would have thought that you can study engineering after coming into a faculty of agriculture. Then we have the Department of Crop Science, we have the Department of Animal Science, Food Science and Technology, which is our host department today, and the Department of Soil Science, Department of Agricultural Extension, where you can study videography, filmmaking, etc. <coughs> and we have agricultural economics and business management. So you can see the wide array of subject areas that are on offer in the Faculty of Agriculture. So one of our biggest strengths of the faculty is our human resource. That is none other than our academic staff members who are very, very conversant and they have been trained at world's leading universities. So 40% uh, of our staff are full-blown professors and they are uh, very capable of providing guidance to our students. So we maintain a very healthy student to teacher ratio of 1 is to 10. Um, so it's not just the academic um, activities that we provide you with uh, assistance, but also we provide you uh, uh, support with respect to your welfare as well. Um, if you have seen the latest reports, uh, two of our uh, professors, Prof. Nirajan Rajapaksha and Prof. Vesha Mendis, are among the uh, world's uh, top 2% of best scientists uh, for the fourth consecutive year. So we are really proud of that. So that is the um, the level of capability that our uh, uh, academic staff uh, carries. A little more about the physical setup of our faculty. You know, it's a very picturesque setup we have. This is part of our Garden University uh, and also our MI sub campus, which is, um, uh, which is uh, in the area of Mahayu Palama, uh, provides a very peaceful setup and provide a very nice learning environment for students to conduct their academic activities. So we have um, four farms that are established in uh, four different agroecological zones of the country. So this provides you uh, first-hand experience uh, on um, agriculture because we believe if you want to actually manage agriculture, 
first of all, you have to experience what the farmers actually experience. So that is the reason why we provide you in-depth knowledge in terms of uh, your skill development at the very grassroots level. Um, so some of the recent additions in the faculty with the help of uh, uh, World Bank funding and some other well wishers, we were able to set up skill laboratories. These are state-of-the-art facilities that we have. We have smart classrooms, virtual study zones, um, sort of activity areas for you to uh, conduct your academic activities more effectively. So I think I mentioned um, uh, in our vision statement, one uh, important area is outreach activities. So our faculty has very well uh, fully fledged outreach arms ranging from um, business incubation centers to analytical services. Um, and most recent addition is the um, uh, genetically modified organism testing laboratory which is located at the Agricultural Biotechnology Center at Mimathur. So Agriculture Education Unit, it's um, another um, uh, outreach uh, arm of the faculty. So this entity hosts international students uh, and they provide um, uh, summer internship programs for international students. And this 